Great warm up everybody. Now we're gonna run through our boxing basics. So to start, your feet are gonna be about hip distance apart. Uh, whichever hand you write with, for me, it's my right hand. We're gonna take that foot and that shoulder backwards. Uh, you want your feet to make a bit of an L shape. And then we're gonna tuck that lead shoulder in so that our stance is a bit bladed, right? We don't wanna be what we call square, where everything is facing forward. We wanna be bladed, nice and safe, keep the face protected, keep your body protected. So the first punch that we're gonna throw is called our one, and that is gonna be with your lead hand, nice and straight. You're gonna keep your elbow tucked and lead with these big two knuckles right out in front of your face. Right? If you're left-handed, everything would just be switched. So like you're looking in a mirror, right? But for now, I'm gonna stay in my right-handed stance. And let's throw 10 of those together, right? So we're gonna go one, two, good. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10. Good work, everybody. Our second punch is the two. Uh, with the rear hand, we're gonna throw straight across our body and then pull it back. So from the side, it would look like this. With this punch, you might notice I'm twisting my hips, I'm twisting my foot, and I'm going into a bit of a lunge, just like when we were doing the twists, right? So with the two, you really wanna try to get a lot of power generated from your leg and then bring it right back to your face. Let's throw 10 of these together, okay? One, two, good, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, good. Whenever you're throwing one hand, that opposite hand stays nice and tight on your face to protect you from a counter punch, right? So next up, we have our three, and our four. These are called hooks. How you wanna visualize this is if you were trying to come around my hands and hit me on the side of the face, you would throw a hook, right? So we'll start with our three. That's our lead hook. We're gonna visualize like we're wrapping our arm around a pole, twist that lead foot and hip over, and then bring it right back. Just like that, good. Let's throw 10 of these together. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good work. And then same thing with the rear hook, right? Wrapping our arm around a pole, twisting our hips, twisting our shoulders, bringing it right back. Let's throw 10 of these together. One, good, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Nice work. Our last two punches are our five and our six, our uppercuts. So with the uppercut, what you wanna try to do is make a U shape with your hand and then bring it right back to your face, okay? So this lead uppercut, U, right back to your face. And I'm twisting my hips ever so slightly into this. Good work. Let's throw 10 of these together. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good. Last punch is our six. Same thing. Twisting the hips, twisting the foot, making a U shape with our hand. Let's throw 10 of these together. Last one. Let's go for it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Good. Now let's throw all six punches in a row. I'm gonna call it out. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. Let's do it at medium speed together, okay? Let's go. One. Two, three, four, five, six. Good. 
Pick up the pace. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good. Let's do one more full speed. One, two, three, four, five, six. Good. We're ready to box. Now that we're familiar with the basics of boxing, we are gonna do a few rounds together. Our first round, we're just gonna throw our straight punches, so our one and our two. If you're familiar at all with your boxing footwork, I encourage you to work that in to the round. But if not, just in place, and you're really gonna focus on your form, bringing your hands right back to your face, and then we're gonna start speeding it up towards the end of the round. So I'll count us in. Three, two, one. Let's do it. One, two, one, two, one. And once you get comfortable here with just the one, two, you can start doubling it up on the same side. So you can throw one, one, two, 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 one, one. And then go back and forth and have fun with it. Remember to stay in your stance. If you're more experienced, like I said, you can start moving around. Two, step, one, two, step. Take it nice and slow. We're here for another minute and a half. So, pace yourself and mix it up. I like to breathe out when I punch. Tighten my core. One, two, good. One, one, two. Don't be afraid to mix it up. Throw three, four jabs in a row, why not? Every punch also has a colloquial name. So if I call it the jab, I just mean the one. It's very confusing. All right. Ten more seconds. One, one, two. One, two, one, two. Try to get as many out as you can. And that's time. 